growing up, I never thought that I would be in not only Saskatchewan, but anywhere in Canada. Um, I've grown to love this country. I think this country has grown to love me. And I, you know, I've, I've had so many great experiences. My, my goal all growing up was to play in the NFL and to be a star in the NFL. And fortunately, that didn't happen because when I was in the NFL, I was miserable. So coming to Canada um, gave me fulfillment. It gave me an opportunity to play a game that that I've loved so dearly for you know from the day I could you know even touch the football. It's been a great ride, and I've had lots of fun. I've won lots of championships. I've had a lot of individual uh, accomplishments. But with that being said, I want to thank all my teammates who I played with, all the coaches who put in the effort to put me in a position to to win championships and have individual su success. He's obviously a, a legend in this league. He'll be a first ballot Hall of Famer for sure when he becomes available. Uh, the irony of that is that when he does become eligible, he'll uh, go into the Hall of Fame with Anthony Calvillo, the recently retired Montreal Alouettes quarterback, uh, who ironically enough is the CFL's all-time leading passer. So you'll have in the same class the all-time leading receiver, the all-time leading passer,